Hey, what is going on my fellow collectors? Hope you guys are all doing well out there. This is Regan. Thanks for tuning back into our channel. In today's video, we are going to unbox and review this another newly released figure of Hot Toys for this month, probably the last one, right? And this is none other than Yelena from the Marvel Studios Black Widow film. MMS622, a 1-6 scale collectible figure. And before we start, if you're new to our channel, please consider to subscribe and press the notification bell if you want to get notified once I upload a new video, especially Hot Toys. Without further ado, let's dive in. Alright, so this is the art box and I would say it looks absolutely fantastic. It looks really really nice. It's pretty neat and I personally like the you know the design of this one. I like the green color, especially that you know that cover up you know for that picture, which is really amazing. Right on the side, it's pretty neat, see? Very nice presentation of this art box. I really love the print. And at the back, also very very neat, I would say, right? Amazing. So anyway, so let's slide it up so we can see the full art box inside. So on the top, this is how you're going to see it. So slide right there. Oh my, this is nice. Yeah, yeah I mean, it looks pretty neat, I would say, right? Yeah, very simple, but you know, very straightforward, I would say. Yeah, and then you can see the kind of like a canvas, uh, yeah, canvas print design style on the print of the picture of Yelena which is from the film not the figure on the side there you go and there you go that's the figure right there really nice picture and on the side the same on the other side and of course you could open the front part Ooh, so you can see right away what's inside the box and that's a very nice presentation of the packaging right there okay nice you could, you could really display like this your display cabinet if you don't want to you know take it out um, the figure yeah just remove those plastic cover and then that's it you have automatic uh, you know display case amazing so let's go let's open it I want to see the closer look of this figure check the instruction sheet so there you go it's very thin it's just one small piece of paper okay mm -hmm. okay not much but uh, of course make sure to check it out so at least you won't miss you know any parts or accessories that you're going to attach okay okay I'm gonna start off with this extra joint right here two pieces and it's very small there you go so two pieces extra joint right here and with some buttons right here and next up is four pairs of extra interchangeable hands with different gestures this one is a fist holding the weapon or his gun or his pistol this one is holding the baton okay, and then right here just the open hand gesture so we have four pairs of extra interchangeable hands okay this one right here is her pistol I would say it looks good it's pretty neat I mean the paint application yeah looks good there's no oh yeah you could move right here oh nice there you go nice amazing okay so next up right here is the baton with some articulated functions and i would say it looks really cool let me try those articulations there you go it's pretty smooth okay and other side i mean the other one nice i think just this one this one yeah this one doesn't have so just you know four articulated uh, function i would say Wait, 90 degrees of course we get another wielding buttons right here but this one doesn't have the articulated function so it's fixed and looks really really nice I love the details you guys can see that uh, especially the handle and some small yellow details or paint you know print right there looks really good okay and then last button 
she got right here is the um, combined baton. Yeah, so it's a longer one, the longer stick. Okay, but this one you cannot detach. Yeah, it's not detachable. It doesn't have any articulations. So, yeah, the details is same with other batons. Okay, next up right here is the knives. So we got three pieces of knives right here. Okay, I would say it's pretty neat. Okay, simple details. Okay, not much, but I would say yeah, it's pretty neat. You know, I put this one right here. And the last accessory right here is the headset. I would say it looks terrific especially the paint job amazing right there and also some wet rings right there very nice details okay uh, movable no there's no movable part okay mm, you could open but I'm afraid that you're gonna break this one if you you know open that headset uh, too much see right there so also this one is probably oh yeah we could turn a little bit yeah in front of her mouth kind of like this right nice amazing and of course let's get the figure oh my goodness this is really nice wow okay let's remove those plastics first There you go guys oh my goodness that is amazing looks pretty nice okay so just a quick look again before we check the articulations right there okay let me get the base there you go that's very neat I would say and of course the holder crutch holder right here very tight and then of course her nameplate Yelena Belova right so I think that's pretty much everything included in the box so now I'm gonna check the articulations all right so now let's check the articulations I'm gonna start with the head okay it's pretty smooth there you go 360 you could do that and then this one doesn't have a joint on the neck extra joint but yes we could uh, you know bend over look up that is a nice we're kind of like a seamless material on the neck that is amazing to the side wow that is amazing right there you go see very nice articulations on the on the head I mean the range of motion is almost perfect you know I would say because you could really do a lot of you know poses on the head okay that's it amazing okay let's move on to the arms all the way up to 90 degrees I think. yeah you could even uh, lift that arms above 90 degrees see nice and then to the front all the way up as well amazing wow to the back there you go other side fantastic wow swivel uh, kind of actually the swivel is on the elbows okay so not on the arms not here okay even here okay so that's the elbow elbows uh, swivel and then also the bend Wow, very nice range of motion. Also, other side, double jointed, very smooth, not ratchet joint, but at least, you know, we could get that, you know, um, uh, very nice range of motion, double jointed, and closer to the body. Something like this. Amazing. Okay, let's move on. The wrist joint, I would say, a pretty decent, you know, the normal one. And this one is not attached properly. this one yeah a little bit tight I would say not bad ok 
okay and then move on let's move on to the upper body crunch in I could feel there is wow it's amazing arch I could already feel that we go to you know have fun playing with this figure especially the poses and then side oh, wow at least right see wow that is amazing twist damn not bad actually it's perfect right very nice articulation see wow very nice range of motion I mean like really big okay you got crunch inside and twist fantastic let's move on to the legs legs all the way up to mm, okay this one is something not really okay <laughs> to the back Okay, not bad right to the back but then the ra raising the legs to the front is kind of like hmm, limited I would say see mm, I mean like just below 90 degrees because of the pants that they use it's quite thick I could feel already something like there's a lot um, probably because of the belt I think we should lift the, those straps a little bit higher but it, no that's it there that's it guys see so even if I try to lift that hmm, that belt it will somehow stays there because of these straps right here on the legs okay the holster so I think I think it's I think it's fine not really really bad but probably we're gonna have some you know limited you know poses because of the legs just a little bit you know not really big one Okay, more than just like you know because I'm, I was thinking about like you know kneeling down okay, anyway let's move on to the knees the knees it's uh, also quite tight and smooth double jointed fantastic wow this one too amazing right swivel oh doesn't have wow wait let me open this legs oh, okay that's the max mm. so the material of this uh, of her pants is not stretch I would say yeah not stretch As you can see right there okay it looks like you know it is a stretch material but it's not okay up to there that's the max guys okay the ankle part hmm oh yeah this one is oh, I would say it's okay it looks good but hmm, uh, I think you guys saw that already when I tried to remove the plastics the joints kind of like you know towards the front so I'm not sure about you know the articulation so yeah twist turn out turn in is okay it's quite loose I would say not tight okay side nice some tilt there to the side okay thing looks good okay that's it for the articulations I would say um, you know fantastic right especially the upper upper body right the the waist part the arms the head amazing hey okay. Um, okay before I review this figure I mean the details uh, let's attach those or let's put those weapons accessories to her body I'm gonna start with the pistol right here there you go okay a little bit loose I think it's fine okay and then also her knives three pieces right here on the side that looks really cool love the holster of the knives the details I love the details guys there you go okay nice amazing that is amazing very nice details okay and of course the baton um, doesn't have any um, parts to put the baton but she's gonna hold it uh, I'm gonna do it later on the poses okay this one her headset let's try this on wow that is really really cool I think I'm gonna use the headset um, you know on the display once I display her All right looks better I mean without the button also nice but something you know 
something different you know once you attach the headset you know something unique I would say right not just the heads cup see looks good bam that is amazing okay let's review the details okay this one right here um, on the boots I would say it looks really good especially the weatherings on the boots okay the details very light the color is not that sharp but I would say it's pretty neat you know you can see right there especially the details yeah looks nice and then her pants the tailoring yeah looks really good especially this one right here oh wait this one see those tailorings I mean like the patterns wow that's really nice patterns right there okay see wow and of course it's very easy to get stained because it's white color if you're going to hold it especially this one looks like already ooh. yeah okay so just be careful anyway yeah the weathering on the knee pads yeah this one is velcro design so you can detach that slowly yeah just slowly because this is very small uh, um, it's this like stitch just be careful when attaching it or in detaching it okay the weathering looks really nice I would say see right there and uh, again the holster made out of uh, this one plastic hard plastic I really like the straps guys see very neat right that is you know very fine you know I would say see nice I'm not sure yeah I think we could detach this one but slide down we have to slide it down um, once you detach it from here okay yeah made out of plastic hard plastic this one also a plastic fabric material kind of like a satin fabric material kind of like smooth eh? yeah, this one is smooth and um, hmm, again the belt also nice made out of rubber not uh, fabric this one also plastic that's why it looks really good so they didn't use a you know fabric material okay see yeah it's kind of like a plastic rubber material so you could easily uh, bend over and this one yeah also plastic rubber okay up to uh, up to here it's like a jumpsuit okay and then the arms yeah you could also slide this one this one is also made out of plastic very nice weatherings on those pads armor right there okay yeah, you could slide this one up and down you could remove that or detach also this one right here this one is also velcro design there you go okay but better not to you know remove it so it will not get some I mean it will not damage you know and uh, it become loose you know the the connection to the velcro anyway um, this one the vest I uh, huh, discover something like this uh, probably it's in the you know instruction sheet so this one has a magnetic design which is really really cool <laughs> right see oh wow <laughs> you heard that sound it's really cool Okay, so you could we could detach this one uh, if you want to just use the whole jumpsuit um, this one we cannot sit down I mean the zipper I'm not gonna remove the plastic so I could you know return exchange just in case there's a problem but yeah I would say it looks good the skin tone is fantastic see it really matched to the face of the head sculpt very nice in the inside part look of this vest there you go okay very raw I would say yeah very nice details and you know patterns on the vest this one I hope this one will not flake this kind of quality right so fabric material and some you know a little bit of metal parts especially this one right here probably just plastic you know and then you know they just paint it to silver or chrome 
color yeah very nice tailoring i would say just a little bit uh kind of like uneven you know i could see some parts that not really clean you know uh, i think it's okay it's fine very nice shape see right there the body that they use on this figure is absolutely fantastic i would say okay and then of course last but not least is the head cup i would say you know it's beautiful you know um if you're going to ask me probably 90 to 95 percent likeness to yelena uh belova i mean you know the act to the actress i forgot her name so anyway yeah she looks really good i mean the head cup the hair cup as well see very nice Okay, even the earrings also nice as well amazing see right there wow okay yeah i love the you know the scope on this uh you know this figure yeah okay not bad you know i would say again 90 to 95 percent likeness i cannot really say like 100 percent because i could still see that you know in some angles it doesn't look like you know her right but yeah it's still a great uh, looking you know head cup right there okay I think that's it that's it um, I'm gonna do some poses and yeah there you go and my final thoughts on this Elena Belova figure I would say she is absolutely stunning a great looking figure you're not gonna go wrong with this figure if you're planning to get her However, I cannot really say that this figure is a must-have or a must-buy because she's not the main character or, you know, some collectors not really into her. But if you really like her, especially if you're really a hardcore fan of this character, this actress, you know, Florence Pug, then I think this is definitely a must-buy for you. You're going to love this figure. The details, the accessories and articulations are fantastic. Even though the head cup is not 100% accurate or likeness to Florence, to the actress, Florence Vogue, I honestly think that still a beautiful masterpiece, you know. And this is something or kind of figure that Hot Toys will not going to make it happen again, you know. Or they're not going to make it again. You know, just my own opinion, maybe. Um, probably not in the near future or probably this is the last one you know even though she's also part of the Hawkeye series Hot Toys never launched or you know um, announced anything about Elena figure from that version from that series right so I think this will be the last Elena figure that we are going to get so if you're really into her I think you should really get her now especially if you're planning to complete the line of Black Widow film However, we haven't heard about the Red Guardian and you know, hopefully we could get Melina, you know, their mother as well, right? So yeah, I mean, this is a great looking figure, then you should really add her to your collection, especially together with Black Widow. That's going to look great, guys. So I think that's about it. That's all I could say. Let me know your thoughts on this figure as well. Feel free to comment down below. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't yet. Until then, see you in the next one. Peace.